Welcome to Pacific Dunes. This just may be my favorite of the courses at Bandon, though that's a little like picking your favorite supermodel. There isn't a bad course on the property. We're back at it after a quick break for lunch, and the beautiful thing about Bandon is it's all golf, all the time. You get a discounted rate on your second round of the day, and for golf junkies like us, we just can't get enough. The breeze is picking up as this is the windiest day of our trip. We mixed up the game for this round of golf, and rather than the three on one we did at Old Mac, we did a round robin style. That means six holes with each of the three possible pairings, so to start it off, I'm playing the first six holes with Carlos as my teammate. If you haven't already seen the matches at Old Mac, I highly suggest going back and watching them. It's been about an hour since I've hit a golf ball, and let's just say that I did not flush this two iron. He's just fine. It's a lunch ball? Second time. Yeah, these guys are jerks. Now there's money on it, so. <laughs> With that. Four. You're okay, you're in the seventh fairway. Alright. Let's get him, Carlos. Woo! We got him right where we want him. Back. I just didn't want to birdie the first hole because that's not good. So. <laughs> I figured I'd hit the wedge first. I want to think like 200 with this breeze. Okay. Where, what am I aiming at? So, see the crow up there on the right? You can probably see the flag if you come up on the top of this slope. It's just going to be a little right of that kind of wide tree up there. Yeah. Yeah, if you jump up, you can see it. Oh, okay, yellow one. Yep. Am I going at the flag? Nah, uh, keep a little right. A little right. Okay. So that little kind of low spot, the tree's back there. Oh, yeah. Like you've got, you see what I'm saying? That U, not not the sharp V, that U to the right. Yeah, that far right. right. Yeah, okay. Yeah. That's like right edge of the fairway from here almost. Mm -hmm. yep. Two bills. <laughs> Two bills. All right, gotta hit this hard then. Oh, I yanked that. Hit it hard though. Get on the golf course. And I do hit it hard. Find it, hit it again. Gonna have to get up and down. It's a rough start. My partner Carlos also struggled off this first tee, but he has a shot from the other fairway. We'll have to scramble here as we're giving a pop to both Sean and Miller. How do we make five? Is six the highest loft you got? It is. Okay. I'll do a 60 here. Yeah, you what? I'll do a 60. I always leave 60 short, so I just. Took out of the bag. Okay. Well, I'll have to open the face and hit this hard. What is it to cover that bunker? 30, 28, 28. You got plenty of room long left. If you're not comfortable with the lie, I mean, I think you can get out just fine. I Otherwise, you can go out yeah. to the right a little bit. But, uh, sorry, favorite right or left? Uh, a little bit left of it. Left of yeah, it. you can be left and long and you not have any problems. 28, carry. 35, just to make sure. All right. I don't know what it's going to do. <laughs> this is a tough little shot here. I've definitely compounded mistakes. I'm short sided from the deep stuff over a bunker. Not ideal. Oh man, tough start. Two tough shots. I've made the cardinal sin of leaving in the bunker, and my bunker game has not been great lately. Not a ton of green to work with, but on the bright side, I don't have to worry about birdieing the first hole. Sean with a decent little lag up near the hole, and he'll have a chance for par. Settle. Not bad. Not okay. yeah, it's just super. Which, after Carlos misses his par putt, 
would be good enough to win the hole for his team. I struggle to double. Too many mistakes on the short par four. Sean misses his par, but a five net four is enough to win the hole. That is not right. The second hole is another short one at Pack Dunes, a little more forgiving than number one, so it's a driver. Is it in the bunker? I think it's in the top half. Yeah. Oh, goody. Right at those trees in the back. Okay. Send it. Send it. Yeah. Great ball. Thank you. Beauty. That is funny. That was spanked. Yeah, there might be a little red ass in that one. That was a scoop. There's dope. Great ball. Yeah. Did you skip that? He did. It went through that grass. <laughs> it definitely did. From this close in, I just kind of flaked like a little 50 or something. Yeah. 52. Got a 52. It's 70 basically. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I just go pin singing right at it. Let's do it. Keep going. Oh. Too much. It's a good it's swing though. Indian, it's, not... it's a good swing though. Hit that well, flighted it. Maybe the back of the green. Sean with a long putt for birdie here and maybe trying to get a little so too creative. Left, trying to work back at yeah, the end. Partial. I think there's just a little more left than there is right. Okay. I think it's just it's double breaking. Yeah. But I like a little more right to left. And pretty speedy yeah, that last good. eight good feet. Okay. Right through there, it really picks up pace. And the wind's pushing it. Absolutely. This means that I have a birdie putt to win the hole. Come back. Come back. Come back. Wow, good putt. Par. It's just a par. So both Miller and Sean have a chance to match me. Right to left there, huh? Miller, yep. I, don't, I don't think it's a crazy amount. Just a couple cups. Yeah. It's low. Yeah. Miller comes up dry. I'm gonna leave it short. Carlos with an easy bogue. Oh. And after Sean just misses, we're back to even for this first six hole match. So far five. Yeah. It's gonna be a long one today. This hole looks familiar. It's because ship sticks, Peter Millar, and Street Down Clothing use it as the opening shot in their TV commercials. Oh really? Yeah. Hi partner. See ya. The coupon tan off right in the beginning of the ship stick commercial. Right here. I've never made it to the hole, I don't think, so <laughs> not to this one. I'm going to aim at the right side and hit on the left side. How's that? You're on the pro line. That's perfect. Yeah. That's exactly where I was aiming to. Matt knew you were going over yep. there. Furthest left I would go is kind of the golf bags, yeah. but um, to that gorse where the dead tree is, 175. Right? Okay. So it's definitely in range. 
Yeah. Like I'd start this at that little gap in the left of the flag, yeah. turn it over a little bit and try to scoot it up there. Using the tangent caddy to take a quick look at the wind and get an idea for what this might do after I hit it. 17 miles into us. All right, this is not an easy shot, but the layup is not easy either. So we're gonna send it. Try to get up there close. That's probably in the greenside bunker, but well struck into the wind. Maybe it'll be short. I don't hate it. Carlos, the nice little wedge to the front of the green. I was lucky to stay just short of the greenside bunker. A dime, right? So I can imagine I can go about 35. Yeah, it'll sit right down in this wind. Definitely not going to roll out. A little right of it. A little right of it. Okay. Let's do something. Go, Dallas. Oh, really good. Oh, oh almost. Nice shot. I guess it was good. Well <laughs> Never <Never> down. <laughs> Thought I went to short. Yeah, well played. Nice shot, Bill. Got away there. I'm not entirely sure this was intentional from Sean. I didn't hear him call backboard, but he did have his hat on backwards, so it's a good play nonetheless. Very strategic. <laughs> like and subscribe. Yeah. Uh, but I do pop Dallas. Okay. Oh, I missed that. Really bad. Carlos, two putts for an easy par. Oh, I did not hit that close. Nice. So I gotta put that. Sean struggles to a bogey, but I have a birdie putt to take the hole, even with Miller popping. Carlos and I take the lead going into the fourth hole. The fourth hole is a generous hole along the coastline, a straight, longer par four that was playing downwind. It's got bunkers strategically placed that make it a little tougher to thread one out there, but you can go as far left as you want, just don't miss right. I expected this ball to draw, but the wind held it straight right down the course line. It'll bounce for sure. I just when it, which way it slows down. Dang. Couldn't see it on the scope. Huh? I couldn't see it on the scope. It was Matt, I, thought, flirty. Uh, I think Miller's in the second bunker. Ah. I'll hit it at the bunker. I was supposed to hit it at it just stay straight. Well with the upslope maybe nine, but I think you just gotta get her out, right? Yeah yeah so no hero shit here. Nope. Oh, I didn't touch I didn't touch it, but no, it's good. Yeah. I can appreciate Miller's honesty here in a mostly fun buddies match, but I couldn't see the ball move on video. Oh, Miller and Dare, come on, bro. Okay, we're not terrible. See it, it's enough. Take this quick minute to smash that like and subscribe. Every little bit helps me grow this channel and it would be much appreciated. 110, just thinking like 95. Yeah. I'm trying to bounce it short. That okay. a little bit left of it too. Yeah, front edge is 100, I think 90. 95, 90, kind of flyer. Okay. We did not find my ball. Best drive of the day was out by a yard. So we've taken a drop. Got a putt for par. That's all we can ask for, dunking it off of the tee. That's the best tee shot I've hit all week. Must have missed it by 10 yards.
I'm going to need Carlos to bail me out on this hole for this match. Luckily, he hits a good wedge. Sean makes an easy par, net birdie, which means this par putt doesn't matter for anything but pride. Uh, Miller makes his bogey, which means Carlos has a chance to win the hole with a natural birdie, net eagle. Instead, oh. it's a push. We oh, remain yeah, one up in the match. Yeah, that is a lot of that. God. And that takes us to the first par three of the front nine, playing a little over 150 yards. Oh no. Right back to that pin. Back down. Miller is wearing out these bunkers, but he's starting to find his form and doing well to get out of them. Carlos with the birdie putt. Push it, push it. <laughs> that just comes up dry. Damn it. <laughs> Miller can save par after the circus bunker shot. Travel. But he'll have to settle for bogey. Wind pushing this? I know. With Sean in tight, I need to make this to put the pressure on. Yeah. Yeah, I, I think you gotta give it up. I play it right here. Okay. Just half the cup. Yeah, especially right now, it's blowing. Pretty flat? Yeah, not like flat. Almost, almost slightly up. There it goes. And it just tails off. That's a par. Yeah, I mean, that's why, I mean, I had him breaking up the hill. Sean has a chance to square the match. Oh, oh nice, nice birdie. Two dots. And does. That's a birdie. Which takes us to the sixth and final hole of this opening pairing for the match. A short par four, but the second shot's to an elevated, thin, narrow green. It's a tough little hole. Good hit. Let's run. What's up? Oh, thanks. Well, I'm just yeah. defensive. All right, Sean started right at the flag. Woo! Love it. Love it. You're fine over there. I, like I know it feels horrible, but it's just fine. <laughs> just <laughs> kidding. <laughs> Yeah. 
perfect. So that's your option if you want to hit driver. That, that, that's what it brings in. And then leave you that little what short, short that little one. flip shot. Yeah. I hit that one well. I don't like left to right winds either, right? That's where I tend to block it. Got it. Miller's at the bottom of the hill and has to hit way up to the elevated green. Sean and Carlos are in the right fescue, they'll have a slightly better angle. My aggressive tee shot has left a good little angle. Light something here. Same idea as uh, a couple holes ago. 48. Yeah. And should check. Yeah, and it's uphill. It's gonna try to work to the left a little bit. Okay. That's Good. fun. We got it. But I nuked it. Good aggressive swing, just a little too much. The wind is making it tough. Not a bad shot. A little long. We got a birdie putt though. Let's go get it. Sean just missed the green with his approach, but he's been playing well from just off the green. Miller gets absolutely robbed here. Get it, get it. Oh, hey, we missed the lift. And Carlos wins the last hole for us with a birdie. Nice right. birdie, Carlos. Thank you. Good read. Bird. Mm -hmm. Oh, beautiful putt. My putt doesn't matter for the match, but it's an easy par. Just didn't quite. Uh, One ball left, Sean. Otherwise known to fellow Texans as a Lance Armstrong. Two in a row! And that's a big par from Sean, but Los and I take the first six holes, so I'll play the next six hole rotation with Sean as a partner on the next episode of The Good Miss.